The annual Consumer Electronics Show is looking much different for 2021 CES. It's not taking over Las Vegas. Instead, it has gone all digital. Today is opening day, and digital lifestyle expert Mario Armstrong is here to give us a sneak peek. Hey, Mario, how is it going so far? Well, it's going great. You know, it's really different. I'm used to walking around with 100,000 other people from 110 different countries, acres and acres of, you know, people looking like a herds of cattle going around <laughs> seeing different technology. Uh, so I'm actually having, to, you know, enjoying doing this on multiple devices and trying to see what's going on. So I pulled together a couple of brands that I partnered up with and I was like, hey, what do you got going on? Let me know what the announcements are. Let me see if they're worthy of the audience. And so I pulled together a few things and from home entertainment, I'm going to talk about TVs to laptops and to smart kitchens. That's really making a big change. Okay, very cool. Well, Mario, if I hear you correct, you're not getting your steps in. Basically, you're just sitting there telling us all about it but let's no. go ahead and start with home entertainment no i got to do extra workouts at home in order to get in those 30,000 steps that i would normally get in all right so first up i want to talk about tvs the new lg 2021 oled tv lineup is here and i'm showing now this is the g1 tv with incredible picture and wow. sound quality for the most immersive viewing and entertainment experience looks incredible super super thin it's really like a piece of art. It's really it's art inspired uh, by the rest of their gal uh, gallery series and uh, lots of technology. I mean, look at that. Lots of technology into it, like the upgraded OLED Evo display, which delivers a brighter picture, a new processor, which really gives it new uh, outstanding picture quality, but also immersive sound because it's the first TV that automatically gives you the best sound for the content on your screen. And it has what's called a fast refresh rate, which is really great for those uh, sports, movies, and uh, gaming, next-gen gaming. And as you saw there, when it mounts against the wall, they give you this mountable design, and it sits for, it sits oh like flush goodness. perfectly up it's against the wall. It's razor thin. Like that, that's unbelievable. Wow, okay. I've got it. Okay, let's move on. Really? What about the laptops? Okay, all right, laptops. Everyone's working from home. A lot of people are anyway, and they're doing schoolwork from home too. So you need to have a great laptop. This is the most impressive announcement in laptops I saw at CES, the Lenovo ThinkPad X12 Detachable. Now, the X12 uh, from Lenovo really combines the features of a high-performance laptop, but you also get the flexibility of a detachable tablet. It's a 12.3-inch uh, screen that you can detach from it. So you got this flexibility of using a laptop, but you also get a better viewing experience for entertainment. Plus, you can use digital accessories like the pen to draw and write right on it. And I love that it's protected by the Corning Gorilla Glass. Hmm. So no worry about your kid like breaking or shattering <laughs> that glass, which is really great. They've got to stick to their own devices. And when we talk about devices, we're, right. we're hearing a lot about smart homes these days. What do you have in that category? We are, and Moen has really blown me away. They are leading the way at CES with smart water products and their new Moen app. Check it out. This is the U by Moen Smart Faucet. It is a CES 2021 Innovation Awards Best of Innovation honoree. It's the only kitchen faucet on the commercial market with voice and hands-free activation. So you can wow. wand your hand or you could use your voice and simply ask Amazon or Google <laughs> Assistant to remotely start or stop the water flow. It's true. You can even say things like baby bottle or coffee maker and it knows exactly how much and what temperature. Or I could say things like a half a cup of 90 degree water. Boom, done. So I love that it's precise. It still has a faucet. Yes, you can use the faucet, but why would you when you could just use your voice? Wow, are you serious, Mario? That, I mean, that's really cool. I have to admit, I'm usually like one of the later ones I mean, to man. jump on the new technology, but this is some cool stuff. I guess people should really keep up with what the newest and most innovative tech products are out there. It's true, and our website has it all, bestofces.com. And look, we're talking about this starting at around $400. So this isn't something that's like 1100 bucks to like have in your kitchen. Granted, for some people, that could still be very expensive, and I'm uh, understanding and empathetic to that. But still, the fact that we have a touch-free, voice-activated kitchen faucet that's smart, that could do things at specific times and temperatures for 400 starting at 400 is showing you that technology is be trying to become more affordable in faster ways. Yeah, that's pretty cool. And then, Mario, you'll have to come over and program it because that's a whole other story. <laughs> Thanks so much for sharing all this cool CES stuff. We'll talk to you tomorrow. And for more tech tips from the expert himself, visit MarioArmstrong.com.